shift it over to you. All right. Thanks, everybody, for coming on to our Zoom class. I'm really excited. Um, just so you all know, everything is modifiable. I will be going through um, um, th certain movements, what to do. If you've got an injury, I'll give you some pointers. Um, so you'll see that you'll work for me. That's one reason I've got all my friends behind me because we've got a shoulder injury. We've got one just had a baby. So I will show you all different modifiable uh, movements. And I'm going to start with a warm up. So I've got my board here. Not that you guys don't remember this, but I will certainly keep bringing it out. When we get to each section, we will start with one section at a time so that it's not too overwhelming. Our first one is a warm up. So we will be doing some dynamic stretches. We're going to go 30 seconds on. 10 second break, two rounds. So we're gonna run through it and then come back to the top and run through all four of them again. Okay, so I will start showing. Everybody ready? Yeah. All right, warm up. We're going 30 seconds on, 10 second break. We're first starting with the knee squeeze superstar. So you're gonna squeeze your knee end to your chest. Take that same leg that you're squeezing Step out into a lunge. If you can't get all the way down, just take a big step forward and reach back. Superstar, if you've watched Saturday Night Live, you do know Superstar. So then you'll alternate. Take that other knee in. Step out. Superstar, okay? 30 seconds on, 10 second break. Everybody ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Knee squeeze, Superstar. Squeeze that knee into the chest. Step out, get a nice big stretch. You can lean back. Make sure you're alternating sides. We are a little bit on a hill here, so everybody be careful. We're halfway, guys. Get a nice stretch. We're just warming that body up. 10 seconds. Knee speed, superstar. Our next one, I'm going to talk because they're still doing it. It's called Russian Soldiers. So you're going to go and break. You're going to go opposite hand, opposite leg. We're on a 10 second break. We're going Russian Soldiers next, opposite hand. Opposite leg, three, two, and one, go. Make sure that you don't swing the leg. You wanna be nice and controlled. Stretching out those hamstrings. Opposite hand, opposite leg. Nice job. Getting warmed up. <laughs> Got a little bit on a hill, it's a little challenging. I'm gonna talk about the next one as you all are still going push-up position. It's a Spider-Man stretch. You're going to bring the right foot up by the right hand and back. Left foot up by the left hand and back. Ready? And break. We're on a break. 10 second break. Sorry, guys. All right. Ready? And go. Spider-Man stretch. Push-up position. Bring that right foot up. Make sure keep those hips up. You want to make sure that you don't drop the hip. Okay. Nice flat back. By the hand, back and forth. Stretching out those inner thighs. Good. Don't drop the hips. Getting that body warmed up. We got 10 seconds. Next one will be your jumping jack toe touch. Exactly what it sounds. So, and break. Jumping jack toe touch. You will squat down, touch the side of your feet, and come up into a jumping jack. Make sure you squat down. Touch the side, jumping jack. And go, guys. Squat down, chest up, jumping jack. Squat down, chest up. Getting that heart rate up a little bit. Can everybody see me? Make sure a butt stays lower than the chest. 10 seconds. Then we're gonna go back to the top after this. Back to your knee squeeze, superstar. Five, three, two, one, break. 10 second break. Then we're going back to our knee squeeze superstar. Back to the top, one more time through. Ready, go, knee squeeze. Lunge it out, superstar. Good. Might be breaking a little sweat by now. 10 seconds, guys. Then we're going to break, and we've got your Russian soldiers. Three, two, one, and break. 10 second break. 
We got our Russian soldiers, opposite hand, opposite foot coming up. Ready and go. Opposite hand, opposite foot. If you wanna make it a little more challenging, go on the balls of your feet. Nice and controlled. Perfect. Look at my class. 10 seconds. Nice and controlled. Three, two, one, break. Our next one, back to our Spider-Man stretch. Push up position. Right hand up, right foot up by the right hand. Ready? Go. You can hold it for a second. You can try to get a little bit further. We're half tight. Your last one is your jumping jack toe touch coming up. And break. 10 second break. Last one for this warm up is your jumping jack toe touch. Ready? And go. Last one. See if you can crank these out now that we're getting warmed up. Went from being cold and now I'm a little warm. 10 seconds. Oh, anybody feeling anything from yesterday? Yeah. Three, two, one. Everybody take a water break. Quick sip. I'm going to go through our next section. <laughs> All right. Our next section. You guys see this lower body, starting with the lower body. It is a Tabata. Tabata means 20 seconds on, 10 second break for eight rounds. You're staying on the same movement for eight rounds. Okay, you hold this for them, my Vanna. All right, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Your first one, squat jump. Squat position, I'm gonna turn sideways so you guys can see. Feet right outside the hips, toes slightly out, okay? You're going to squat down, so make sure. Hips go back, knees behind the toes, chest up. I use my hand, touch the ground, so I know I get deep enough, and jump. Down, jump. So you want to think about when you're coming up, float off the ground. Now listen, if that's a little too hard, then just squat. Take that squat position all the way down, see if you can get hip crease past the knees, up, full extension, hips at the top down, up, just crank your squats out. All right, it's 20 seconds on, 10 seconds, wait, what? let me go through, sorry, I just realized, I should probably hit them all. Squat jumps, first one, lateral lunges. Second one, we'll take a little break. We'll go into your lateral lunges. Stepping out, I like to use my mat to create a straight line. You don't have to, it just helps me. So when I step out, my feet are parallel, you're going to take that right foot out, this leg on the inside stays super straight. Hips go back. You want to stick the butt way back, get nice and low. So what we'll do on that Tabata, we'll stay on one side for 20 seconds, break, and then we'll start stepping out on the other leg, the left leg. Step out and really push off that outside leg. Remember, if that's still too hard, baby steps, just little pumps, okay? Little pumps, down and up. Your third one, rocket jumps. And I will run back through these, your rocket jumps. I feel like my class is going to be upset with me. <laughs> rocket jumps. Rocket jumps are advanced. So I'm going to show you guys some modifications. I start with my feet together, but you can start apart. You're going to jump into your lunge, try to tap that back knee to the ground, and then explode. Both feet land at the same time. Tap that other back knee. Back and forth. This is very advanced. If you have a hard time with this, I want you to do what I call an aerobic top. Come up, hop back, knee down. Hop back. If that's still too hard, just take it into a back lunge and just try to crank your back lunges out. Okay. Woo. Are y'all ready? Tabata, 20 seconds on, 10 second break. We're starting with the squat jump. You're staying on the squat jumps for eight rounds. Okay. Here we go. Three, 
two, one, and go. Squat jumps or regular squats. Nice deep squat. Or you can jump. Job, guys. Chest up. Three, two, one. Ten second break. That break goes real quick. Woo. Shake your legs out. Staying on our squat jumps. Here we go. Two, one, and go. Make sure that chest stays up. If you get tired, the backside's gonna wanna creep. Three, two, one, break, two down. Two down, six to go. Everybody knows Tabata's a full four minutes. All right, here we go. Ready, and go. Squat jump or squat. Five seconds. Two, one, break. Take it out. Start getting tired. Anybody counting how many they're getting? A lot. <laughs> Here we go. Ready, go. Woo. Legs are burning. 10 seconds. Remember, go at your own pace. Three, two, one. We're halfway. Four to go. Halfway. We will not do these tomorrow morning, I promise. Ready, and go. If you have a knee issue, just work on a little bit of a squat. You don't have to get full depth. Five seconds, three, two, one, break. Whew. So close, we got three left. Ready, and go, squat jump. Whew. Starting to burn. Three, two, one, two left. Way to start with a bang, right? Hope everybody's doing okay. Here we go. Ready, go. If you get tired, go to your squats. Five seconds. Two, one, break. One left. One left. Then we'll take a little water break. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Ready. And go. Last one, guys. Last one on your squat jump. Make sure as you get tired, the rear end's going to want to creep up. Woo. Five seconds. Three. Two, one, take a little break. A little sip of water. Might take a break at home. Grab a quick sip. Try to bring the heart rate down a little bit. Whew. I'm just gonna go over what's next. Lateral lunges. Stepping out, okay? Stepping out, toes wanna stay forward. Make sure you wanna be parallel from the other foot. Nice and low, push off. The outside foot and keep this one super straight. Push. You're going to stay all on the right. 20 seconds. Break. And then we'll go left. Whew. Are we ready? No? <laughs> yeah. I'm like, why did I shower? <laughs> ready. And go. All right leg. Remember, if going too deep is too much, baby steps. Just shorten the range of motion. Five seconds. Two, 
One break. Now we're going to switch sides. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Keep that inside leg super straight. We might be wobbling after this. Three, two, one, break. Going back to the right. These are ones that'll creep up on you. Yeah, one time. <laughs> Ready and go. Just so you guys know, somebody said, we're just running through all this Tabata once, correct? Yes. We will not be doing this again. Good. Five seconds. Try to get nice and low. Keep that chest up. Two, one, break. Left side, here we go. Ready, and go. Load off that left leg. Woo. Three, two, one, halfway. Halfway, guys. Two more on each side. Here we go. Two, one, right leg. Make sure you stand parallel, straight across. Five seconds. Three, two, one, switch inside. Yeah. Get through this lower body, right? Move. Here we go. Ready and go. Left side. Woo, my hamstrings. Screaming. Five seconds. Two. One. One more each side. One more each side. Ready and go. Right leg. If you get tired, remember, watch that form. My hamstring's a little upset right now. Good. Okay. Really push off that outside leg. Two. One. Break. One left. One left. Left leg. Whew. Ready, and go. I'm gonna take a break. Muscles getting a little fatigued. Got 10 seconds, guys. Two, one, break, one break. Quick tip, all right. Last one, rocket jump. Mm -hmm. yeah. Don't do rocket shots. Just do, try some back lunges. No, I'm fine. Modify. I started feeling mine. That's why I was taking a break. We did a lot of hamstrings yesterday, so we're all a little hurting. So your next one, rocket jumps. You can start with your feet together, one in front and the other. Okay, you want to try to get that knee as low to the ground, if not on the ground, as much as possible. Up and switch. Okay, my hamstrings have just locked up, so I'm not going to... I will walk you through it. Um, rocket jumps, you want to up and split the legs at the same time. The idea is to try to get them to touch the ground at the same time. If you cannot do that, you want to take it to a lunge, your lunge, then you will just do a little skip hop forward, lunge back, okay? Or just back lunge, straight into your back lunge. All right, everybody ready? Last thing on that lower body, here we go. Three, two, one, and go. You will see different modifications out here due to injuries or ability level. It's totally fine. You have to listen to your body. I'm trying to listen to mine right now. Listen to your body. Three, two, one, and break. 
yeah, those, yeah. Ready, go, round two. Woo, it's like, nope. Mine's like, no, no. Nice work, guys. Five seconds. Now remember, rocket jumps are gonna get hard really quick. Two, one, break them up where you need to. Two down. It's your last thing on that lower body. Ready, and go. Good. Just back lunge, trying to get that knee as close to the ground as possible. If you can't touch the ground, that's A-okay. Five seconds, three, two, one, break. Woo! Here we go, three, two, one, and go. Even if you just do two at a time, that's fine. Good, 10 seconds. Five, three, two, one, break. We're halfway. Let's see if I can try this. Ready and go. Ten seconds. Two, one. We're almost done. Almost done. So much of a workout is mental. Remember that. Ready and go. Good. We're almost done. Three, two, one. Two left. All right. Here we go. Ready and go. Last two. Hey, can you? Pop fitness. Five seconds, guys. Come on, you got this. Three, two, one, and break. Last one coming up. Don't take a break. We'll go over that upper body. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Last set of rocket jumps. Come on, guys, you got it. 10 seconds. Stay with it. Don't stop, stay with it. Five, four, three, two, one. What a break. You are done with the lower body. Whew. All right. As they're taking their water break, I'm gonna go over with you guys at home. The upper body. I'll show you. I don't know if you can see that, Ann. See me. Upper body. Yeah. <laughs> upper body, we are going to go. Uh, 30 seconds on, 20 second break for four rounds. So it's just like the warm up. You're going to run through all three and then back to the top. We're going to go for four rounds over and over. It's almost like station. Your first one, plank to press, forearms and toes. Okay, make sure chest over your forearms. You're going to take that right hand, put it where that right elbow was, come up to a push up, push up position. Up, up, down, down, and then alternate. Left goes where the left elbow was, down, down. Okay. And that plank to that push-up position. It's your first one. So a couple of modifications on your knees. Take it to your knees. It's less pressure on the shoulders, okay? Or if you have a hard time with that, I want you to either you can hold a plank or you go on your knees and work on your push-ups all the way down and up, okay? Next one, sea turtles land on your stomach. Biggest thing, I hope you guys can see me. Okay, biggest thing is keeping that chin on the mat, so do not bring the head up. Chin stays on the mat, hands by your side, legs are nice and straight, and you're going to open up, all the way open up like a jumping jack on the ground, hands overhead, back down by the side, up, 
down. We have somebody in our class with a shoulder injury. So I tell her, don't go overhead. Just come up, like right to past the ears and back down. Around the world is your last one. Uh, around the world. So I would say for you all, maybe off the mat, or you could keep your feet on the mat. You're on a push-up position. Your feet will not move at all. Your hands are going to walk around in a complete 360, okay? Walking around. So what we're gonna do is each round, you'll just stay going to the right side the first round, next time, or whichever way you start at home. Next time you'll switch sides and then you'll come to the left the next round. So you'll be walking your hand to the left or to the right. If you can't make a complete 360, go back and forth. So just do like a semicircle. Come a little bit to the left, tap, a little bit to the right, tap. All right, upper body, am I good? Are we good? Four, no, no, you're done with Tabata. 30 seconds on, 20 second break, four rounds. We're gonna start with plank to press, sea turtle, okay, around the world, then back to the top. All right, are we good? All right, guys, let's do it, I like it. Here we go, three, two, one, and go! Remember, don't let the rear end creep up. Nice flat back. Three, two, one, and break. 20 second break. Sea turtle. Yep. Nice little break. It's a little different than that 10 seconds. All right, laying on your stomach. Keep that chin on the mat. This is so you're only working the back, the posterior chain. Here we go. Three, two, one and go, hands by the side, legs straight, then you're gonna open up like a jumping jack. Keep those hands just barely off the ground, like here on the grass, you'll feel that grass right underneath your arms. Ten seconds. Good, almost done. Three, two. One break. Round the world. Woo. I think we were saying it was cold earlier. <laughs> okay, push up position. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Walk those hands around the feet. Stay still. We're gonna go completely all the way one way for 30 seconds. Ten seconds, guys. Ten seconds. Good. Make sure the butt stay down. Don't let it creep up. Nice tight stomach. Two, one. Break. Back to your plank to press. Plank to press. Good. Remember, if you need to modify, go down on your knees. Okay. Here we go. Two, one, and go. Plank to press. Right hand, right where that elbow was, and then switch sides. Up, up, down, down. So, Misty, I don't know if you guys can see Misty over here has a shoulder injury. So she's doing her, which I told her to do her shoulder taps, push up position, just tapping the hand to the opposite shoulder. Two, one, break. Sea turtles. If you wanna ever make these harder, you add weights in your hand, very light weights. Talking like one to three pounds. Too bad we didn't bring our weights for our sea turtles. Too bad. <laughs> Two, one, and go. Hands by the side, open up like a jumping jack. Keep that chin on the mat the entire time. You wanna keep your arms nice and straight, big hands. 
Open up if you have a shoulder injury. Remember, don't come all the way up overhead. Good, guys. 10 seconds. These are harder than you think. Three, two, one. Good. Round the world. If you went right this way, you're going to lead with the left this time. Or if you went left, you're going to lead with the right. Stay in all one direction for that 30 seconds. You're going to be worn out and hungry, aren't you? <laughs> all right, here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Started with the right, go with the left, walk it around. If you ever want to make those harder, you can elevate your feet. Put them up on a box. Three, two, one, break. Back to the top. You could do this to your T's. Yeah, it's starting to feel. There we go. Three, two, one, back to our plank to press. Round three, round three. Remember, as you get tired, really, really, really important to watch your form. And on these, you need a really nice tight core. I always tell my clients, pretend as if someone's getting ready to punch you. You clench, so that stomach gets real tight. We got 10 seconds. Good, guys, hold on to it. Three, two, one, and break. 20 second break. Back to our sea turtles. Good, 10 seconds. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Hands by your side, open up. Keep that chin on the mat. Arms as straight as you can. Little breaks if you need them. We're halfway. Chin down on the mat. 10 seconds. Good, guys. Here we go. Almost done. Three, two, one. Good. Back to our around the world. We're back to the way that you started with. So we went to the right. We're going to the right again. All right, guys. Three, two, and go. Hopefully, I'm not getting dark. I'm trying to move a little bit closer. If that helps. Woo! We only have one more round after this. Ten seconds. Keep going. Stomach tight. Keep that nice flat back. Three, two, one, and break. Back to the top. One more time through. Place press. One more time. All right, get ready. Last round. Three, two, one. Let's go. Give it all you got. It's our last round of the upper body. Halfway. Ten seconds. Almost done. Three, two, one. Break, sea turtles. We're almost done with the upper body. At least this only gets to lay down, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Keep that chin down. Super straight arms and legs. Woo. 
Ooh, we're halfway. Hold on to it. This is our last round of the upper body. I know you're getting tired. Almost done. Three, two, one. Good. Round the world. <laughs> Everybody laying down. Round the world. Remember, going the opposite way if you did last time. Our last thing on that upper body. Let's take a water break. All right. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. We got 10 seconds. Come on, guys. Three, two, one. Woo! Water break. Our last section. We're almost done. Let me grab my board, get my Vanna. Core. Core. Core today. Going four rounds, but we're going 25 seconds, 15 second break. Okay, your first one, alternating one leg tucks. Your second one, toe taps. Third one, bicycles. So your first one, laying on your back. I will show you guys several modifications because I know with a lot of back injuries, the hardest thing yet one of the most important. So, arms overhead, one leg tucks. You're going to bring one knee up to your chest. For momentum and try to get up and touch your toe. Knee to the chest, hands to your toes. Okay, back and forth. Really important to get its upper body up as high as you can. Okay, so that's advanced. Next one. Just want you to work on getting to your knee. Okay, just crunching to your knee. Your knee back and forth. So hard. Over. Okay, keep your knees tucked. Little crunches, just little crunches. So you just want to shorten the range of motion if you have a back injury. Your next one, your toe taps. Legs straight in the air. You just try to straighten those legs out. A lot of us have a little bit of a on your head. Go up, touch your toes. All the way back. Up, touch your toes. This one should be okay on the back. If you do feel it, again, bend the knee and just try to come up and reach to the sky. Okay, let me punch it. Your third one is nice. The bicycles is the um, form. Your bicycles. Hands behind the head. You're going to bring your opposite knee to elbow and back and forth. You do not want to do this if you guys can see me. So hand up to the side. I tell my client, think of trying to get your shoulder to your knee. So you really want to hit those obliques coming up. Okay? Up. Back and forth. Really rotating. Back and forth. For those of those of you with back injuries can set and you're rotating, okay? Do not, you want to try to keep the elbows out of the side. Do not pull on your neck, okay? That's not really good form. <laughs> All right, are we good? We're almost done. Woo! Yes, oh yes. Okay, so let me tell you on your tuck, I didn't tell you how to make it harder. If you wanna make it harder, keep your feet elevated the entire time as you're tucking, okay? Easier legs on the ground, but that's still advanced. Okay, just remember that. But if you want a little bit more of a challenge, feet stay elevated the whole time, as long as you don't feel your back. 25 seconds on, 15 second break. Thank you, Andrew Duffy. All right, here we go. Last section. Three, two, one, and go. Twenty-five seconds. It sounds better than thirty. Good. We got ten seconds. Three, two, one. Fifteen-second break. All right, get ready, guys. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. All the way back. Touch your toes. Keep those arms 
for momentum. Go, hands on your head, fully rotate. Other leg goes straight out and the knees back. Once that other leg out. Remember, if your back hurts, shorten your range of motion, bend your knees, little crunches. Five seconds. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Remember, think about getting the shoulder to the knee. It's not about speed on the bicycle. Form. Ooh, little breaks when you need them. Two, one. stretching tomorrow morning. Ready, and go, oh, one leg touch. A lot of these ladies come to my Tuesday, Thursday classes, 7.15 and 9.30 outside at the soccer field at Long Point, so they're not excited about class in the morning. Or maybe they are, I don't know. Five seconds, three, two, one, so go. This is our third round, right? Just kidding. <laughs> Get ready, guys. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. You got five seconds. Three, two, one. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Back starts to take over. Remember, shorten your range of motion. If it's really bad, just stop. You have to listen to your body. Three, two, one. One more round. Woo! Wow. 
last round of the day. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Touch. Alternating touch. Ten seconds. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Try not to stop the entire time. So last thing for class. Woo! Come on, guys. We're almost done. Five, four, three, two, one. Yay! Nice work, everyone. High fives around. Thanks for joining us. If you are local, we do have an outdoor program Tuesday, Thursdays outside, 7.15 and 9 a.m. Um, Saturdays at 9 a.m. Also, we are having indoor gym classes. We offer personal training. I started outdoor program because I'm high risk. I have type 1 diabetes. So for those of you high risk or uncomfortable going into the gym still, come join us. Nice work, guys. Wow. Yay. I can't wait. Don't look at my hair. I'm like, don't look at my hair. Don't look at my hair. That's from doing yeah. those sit-ups. Woo. Wow, Anna. Thank you so much. Woo. Thank you. Oh, that was awesome. I hope everybody thank enjoyed you, that Anna. class thank as you, much Kathy. as I did. Woo. Woo. Yay, thank nice work, gracious. guys. Um, our lucky winner tonight is Kristen. How Kristen How you are our winner tonight. So I will email you in the morning with details on your gift card to her favorite store. Oh, it's amazing, yeah. isn't it? Wow. <laughs> Yay. Oh, Anna, thank you so much. Um, thank, oh, thank you, everybody. You guys. So much fun. Hope everybody can tonight. see. Yes, lots of we'll water. see every... maybe a little ibuprofen. <laughs> okay. Lots of water. Yeah. Lots of water. And some stretching. Bye guys. Thank you, everybody. Yay!